Today we'll be cooking up a retrowave track. Retrowave is an electronic music genre that emulates the sound of the 80s. It differs from most present day electronic music in that a greater degree of importance is placed upon melody and composition. A lot of what our current culture is built around was birthed during the 80s. Home computing, the internet, music videos, and cell phones all arose from that decade. So it's not too surprising to see why some people have a great deal of nostalgia for and interest in the 80s, as it was certainly a transformative and influential time in history. Let's get into the cookup. I'm gonna do things a bit backwards today and start off with the drums, which I usually don't like to do. But for this, I think it's gonna help me keep the vibe right, just because these types of beats tend to have the same type of rhythm. And we're just looking for some like old drum machine type samples. Usually I hate working like this because I feel like it's the producer equivalent of putting milk in your bowl before you pour your cereal. So we'll just lay that out like that. Lay down the snare on every other kick. Maybe a little switch up here at the end. And lower that velocity. A lot of lows in that hat there I gotta cut. And we can add this tom to the end to kind of signal that something else is gonna happen. All right, now we're gonna lay down a bass. I know that Flex has a synthwave kit, so probably the most convenient thing to use. Just change the tags here to bass. What is that noise? Okay. That's the one. Maybe add a side chain effect. Okay, I only want it on the one and three. It's a little bit too much. All right, at this point, I'm just gonna try to lay down some chords. Drum these. And maybe add like a tremolo type of effect to it to give it some more dynamics. Too much, oh God, that's distorting. That's some reverb to it. All right, we're gonna look for something to layer the chords with. Ooh, that 
That's a good one. One more layer. I think I'm going to clone this and make a counter melody. All right, I recently got this VST and I've been waiting to use it. It's a saxophone. I'm tired of relying on arcade. Dick my nuts. Dick my nuts. Dick my nuts. When I use loops, it's important that they sound like there's something about manipulating it and just making it my own. That's a vibe, man. Let's lay down some notes. All right, I'm gonna ex export that with some automation. Bro, that is crazy. Needs to be cleaned up a little bit, but I'm gonna mix this and uh, let's see what we've come up with. <laughs> 